women. Um, this was just an eye-opening experience, a firsthand at seeing what the ocean and climate change and human impact is having on our environment. Um, so as a life science teacher, I was able to bring it back to my PLC, as well as the department across from at Clark, um, and just kind of trickle it down throughout interdisciplinary subjects as well um, about how much human impact is affecting everywhere. Um, it was eye-opening at Bermuda to see the amount of garbage. We walked on a beach and the amount of small plastics that we could see at Bermuda due to the currents. Um, there were little plastic pellets that the fish were actually processing through. Um, so we were seeing how it was affecting our ecosystems. Um, it was the first time I've seen real evidence of it. Um, I walk the beaches here and I look for plastics and it's not as, I don't see it here. Um, but that doesn't mean that there's not a problem. So it was something that I could really bring back into my classroom as a firsthand experience to show my students that while you're not seeing it in Lexington, this beautiful horseshoe beach that everyone thinks of pink, pink sand is filled with these mycoplastics as well. Um, so I'm looking forward to starting an oceanography club um, to get the interest of these students, um, hopefully in the future, to bring some students down to Bermuda to work within um, at Bermuda Institute, the bio, the bio station, and do some firsthand authenticity of these microplastics. So.